All right, I'm gonna go ahead and start making this video. I haven't posted my latest video yet. So I'll go ahead and start making this one. We have got a new house. Amy had bought a house, which is my soon-to-be wife. Y'all haven't seen her on the channel. But we started getting crap over here. Had the transmission, the motor, the Camaro, the truck, everything. Do a quick walkthrough of the house. Here's like the foyer. And then here is living room number one. That leads out to the backyard. It has a nice deck and then a pool. And the pool looks like a pond right now. So we've been shocking it and getting it cleaned. We do a clean up video of this whole backyard and everything. Uh, just kind of getting stuff moved in, cleaned up a little bit. We've got the laundry room right there. We walk in here is the kitchen. It's got a nice big spacious kitchen. We've got the dining room area. We're having to run off window units because it's supposed to have central heat in there, but the units need replaced. Got a fire pit there. TV here, second couch here. This is going to be the main living room. Front door there. And then you walk into here. You got this little hallway. You go down, there's a basement down there. It's got a bunch of crap left in it. Here is bathroom number one. Just a regular old shower, a mirror, toilet, window, nothing too special. This is going to be my game room and my computer room and everything. Got a window unit there. I don't have that one plugged in yet. We have a small closet here. This is going to be the main bedroom. It's dirty. We're going to probably have to sting clean this floor or just rip it up and replace it we got the side of the yard out there with another window unit it's got a little sink toilet little tub then there's the two closets we have this room which is the worst room they left a bunch of their shit in here and the floor's all messed up. Over there, there's a hole in the wall where a rodent has been getting in. You got feces and debris all in the carpet. The ceiling fans tore out. None of the outlets work in that room. So we've been just using it as keeping all their trash in there until we can get it all hauled off. But this is just a kind of like a, a beginning video. That way, as I go on and make progress, I can put this clip to show how the house did look. And then I can go back later on and add all the cleaning updates. I'm probably going to go ahead and start moving stuff on this deck and getting everything moved around to where I can clear it off. And we'll be pressure washing it, painting it, everything like that. So I'm going to go ahead and get started on that while I wait for the pool to drain and then we'll be cleaning the pool as well. Had the phone set up on a time lapse over there i don't know how much you could actually see but i've got this back corner the deck cleaned up that's how much or it's just from right there around over here it's all piled up still got to do i got to move that table get up from under it got to do this side of the deck i'm gonna try to set up the angle where you can see all that and put it back in the time lapse and do that real quick
Took a break from the pool for a little bit to let it drain some more. Had a little bit of lunch. Now I'm up on the roof, pulling all the crap out of the gutters. You can see all of this is just from these gutters. Because they're, they're pretty cram packed full. So I'm gonna go through here, clear as much as I can out. Try to help some of the drainage around here. I'll pick up the phone whenever I'm done. It ain't really safe to be on your phone on the roof. All right, I've got all the gutters cleaned all the way across the front. Across this back side and around both corners over here. And over there. Hop down off the roof now. The pool is taking forever to drain. And there's about two to three foot of leaves on the bottom of it. So I need it drained as much as I can so I can get all those scraped off the bottom. And then once all that crap's off the bottom, we can clean it shock the crap out of it wait for it to turn clear scrub it down all that but that's one of the major projects done was cleaning all the gutters out and it should help everything flow a lot better around here all these trees around here for three years just stopped them up but let me get down real quick all right it's later in the evening and you see we've got several piles the leaves on the outsides of the pool and then got half a trash can over here on this side of leaves and the pool was right underneath that white circle and so it's slowly draining it it's a pretty decent sized pool i reckon about four or four and a half foot deep and pretty pretty substantial size but got most of that cleaned up we'll have to burn that off one day we'll have to clean out this little kitty pool that way you can wash your feet before you go down the slide the slide actually has a water hookup we'll get that pressure wash cleaned up but still yet to come back by and turn our water back on but we do have the power on but now I guess I'll let that keep draining and work on the inside a little bit, getting all the old stuff moved out so we can move all the new stuff in. Start out to clean out that laundry room. Got another bag of clothes to clean out. These bags to get out. These closets are cleared out now. Just a matter of getting everything moved out into the living room so we can throw it away. The brother's then downstairs going through the basement. I'll show that later on. There's a bunch of old fridges down there, so it smells really bad. We've got one of them moved outside. As you can see, all down along the side of the house, where I cleaned out all the goodies. There's more trash we gotta take off. So it's gonna be a long, slow process. I'll probably just start skipping a bunch of it and cutting to where it's just do a before and then after, and just skip right to it being clean. One cool thing we found was a whole can old car keys. The guy was a car salesman, apparently, in the 70s through 90s era. All right, so it's the next day we're back over here at the house. I just left the pool and draining last night. And as you can see, over here in the corner, you can see it real well. It's just a pile of leaves on the bottom. I feel like that's how this whole pool is. We've got it down below the third stair, almost to the fourth stair, but it's like...
don't know, maybe like Shin almost knee deep. So it should still be draining, but we're gonna start moving stuff around and see if we can get some of these leaves out. I'll try to set the camera up somewhere, but I can't really promise anything because it's hard to get all the angles of the pool while using the cell phone to record. Okay, it's been a few minutes of moving everything around. See, it's still just piles and piles of that crap underneath there. As you can see, I'm just scooping out a bunch of piles going all the way around the pool. This thing is slam packed full of it. It's just gonna have to drain to almost empty and get in there and get everything out, I reckon. It is pretty disgusting on the sides. So, probably have to drain it all the way anyway to clean everything out. So I'm gonna let that drain for a little bit longer. Started getting all the trash bags up and into the bed of the truck. We've still got a bunch inside the house I gotta drag out here. But it's hard for me to kind of like record everything. So a lot of my videos are just gonna be like Either little time lapses or like I'm gonna do this and then it be done. But we'll go inside, get those bags, try to get them loaded up, try to get the house as clean as possible so we can start moving the rest of our stuff in. And the one back bedroom that's supposed to be the master bedroom, I may be tearing the carpet out of it and putting a new floor in it before we move the bedroom stuff into there just because that carpet's so disgusting. Got the pile of bags out of here. Moved all of them out. This bedroom's clean. This bedroom's clean. Wow, well, I say clean, the carpet's still disgusting. This is gonna be the master bedroom. And I'm thinking about peeling all this carpet up and putting down different flooring. We already have different flooring. We just wasn't gonna do it until after we moved in, but we might go ahead and do it. Because I could put the bed in the living room the time being if I have to. So we've got a couple of our things over here. Uh, haven't went through all this yet. This is all stuff they left, but we've just got that back bedroom that they left, the downstairs they left, uh, getting all the cabinets and stuff cleaned out, and then getting this laundry room cleaned out. And once the pool finally dries, or drains rather, enough, I can get in there and get to it. But you can see, just the other day it was at that white thing, and now it's getting pretty low. So it shouldn't be too much longer, and I can get out there and really start cleaning on that thing. I'm gonna start cleaning out all these cabinets. There's not really much I can do as the video and while I'm doing it. But they left all their stuff. So I'm just gonna get everything out. Get everything cleaned up. It's a bunch of insects or turds. I don't really know. But all the cabinets have to be cleared out, cleaned up. I'm gonna do that really quick and I'll pick up the camera afterwards. While I'm in here cleaning out the cabinets and everything, my brother's out there cleaning off the back porch. 
and burning everything in that little burn pit. I'm going to keep doing this while he's doing that. Then after he's done with that, I'll start moving around some of that stuff and getting it off the porch. And eventually, when they cut our water on, I'll be out there pressure washing that deck and everything, getting it really clean. Okay, I got everything vacuumed out and wiped down. I'll put our plates up there already. Under here, cleaned up our under there, there's a big stain. Yeah. It's been a few days since I've done any recording on the house or anything. I got that kiddie pool cleaned out the other day. It was slap pool. Got the pool drained enough to where you can see all the crap on the bottom of it. We've got a lot of cleaning to do with it. You see, there's the bottom. And it's just covered in crap all across through there. We've got Hank, our husky over here finally he's enjoying the outdoors I stepped home and I'll suffer right alongside him I'm not the love you <laughs> I'm just gonna make a little ender clip here so I can go ahead and upload the video here's how the pole is looking see the liner we cleared it out a little bit i've got a couple clips here and there of uh snapchats i took of like hank getting in the pool and stuff like that i'll put that in uh i haven't really been working on it because we had a water line that had busted and the basement is right over there it was leaking like out of the door frame and i couldn't really figure out where it was coming from but it turned out it was coming from underneath the porch because the water line that goes over to the washer and dryer was not done properly and it has to be replaced so that's kind of putting a hold on stuff but i'll go ahead and get the video uploaded so far the next video hopefully will be actually cleaning this completely out and doing a before and after we're going to clean all the walls and all that once that's done we can start getting all this cleaned up probably get it ready to be painted and all that go ahead and pressure wash the slide stuff like that so until next time